I'm back already. <laughs> I just wanted to make a quick video and express my opinion on gun control. And I, I really want to share this message with my brothers and sisters in the States because with all the crap that's happening, it's set in place so they can take away your guns. Don't let the government take your guns away. Don't let them bully you into thinking that you would be more safe if there were gun laws in place. Take it from me, I'm a Canadian. They took our guns away a long time ago. And I'll bet you there's a lot of Canadians out there right now that are kicking themselves in the ass for letting, for not fighting it. I was kind of young at the time, so I was naive. But you know, now that I spend my time outside by myself in the bush and stuff, I have no protection. And the thing is, I'm not jumping hoops. Canadians, I'll tell you, they really, they screw us from both ends because it is expensive to own a gun. It is expensive to do anything here. And the thing is, for those of you that trust the government and think that, that, uh, that they care about you and, and your well-being, well, you're being misled in a big, big way. And I, I really, truly believe that this Las Vegas thing, shootings and stuff, I seriously believe that that was kind of a setup so that, that they can take your guns away. Because now Trump, I, I, I don't know for sure, but from what I heard is now he's going to start talking about it. Don't let him do it. Whatever you do, don't let them do it. Don't let them take your guns away. Because it doesn't matter how, how easy it is to get a gun or hard to get a gun. If somebody wants to kill somebody, they're going to do it. And it doesn't take a gun to do it. You can do it any which way. There's some pretty easy methods out there, I, I would suspect. I don't know personally. <laughs> but, you know... It, it, the way society is going and the way society is being dumbed down, you have to accept, you have to expect that there's going to be psychos and, and people who are depressed and people who are not in their right mind. I mean, it's not an excuse it, by any means because we all individually have an, a, a, a choice of what we're going to do. That's why I choose to do what I do. I look for my own medicines. I don't trust the government. I don't trust the medical uh, establishment. I don't trust anybody in authority because they don't ask me my opinion when they're making decisions. And that, that's a fact. You know, uh, the Trudeau who's in there now, he's being whipped by his wife, you know, because uh, he's a yes man. So... Uh, whatever. I don't want to get into politics because I, it's just as bad as religion. So I just wanted to put this message out there that it's so, so important. Don't fight it. Fight it. Fight it for all your worth. Don't let them control you. Don't let them take your rights away. Because once they take your guns away and they have made you uh, uh, incapable of defending yourself, then, then it's going to be easier and easier to take every single right you have away. And it's happening here in Canada. You know, uh, we're almost communists. <laughs> but that's how I see it. But anyways, I just want to send that message out there that, you know, I, I, I do feel bad for what happened in Las Vegas. You know, it, it's a shame that this shit has to happen. But in order for them to pull off what they want to pull off, as in the government, they do things like this. And I, I have no trust for the government at all. So, but that's me. Anyways, I am going to say ciao for now. And uh, I will check you out on the next video. So uh, have a good one.